tell the Electoral Commission um, on these legal matters? They should go slow, they should do a lot of consultations, you see. Nobody can claim to have monopoly over knowledge. So what to do is that to do a wide consultation. You know, but if you read the law, and quickly, and I can say on, on authority, she's a lawyer, but she's not a practicing one. I'm not aware how long she practiced. So in these matters, which will affect the, you know, the rights of others, it's only fair that you do wide consultations before you come out to announce certain things. Because, see, what do you think will be the effect of what has happened? And to a uh, morale and the whole morale of the East. I wanted to ask you that question. No, I won't tell you. I won't tell you. Go mm. think about it. This is the, this yes. is the, this is the Electoral Commission. Yes. And um, having lost this I case, said, th think about it. That is why you oppress men. So draw out the necessary inferences. Don't just go and quote people. You see, when we left court after the arguments, was it on, when was it? Tuesday. People said I spoke with the media and that they found something or I said no. I wanted the public to understand. You have, there is no contempt if you report accurately what took place in court. It's not that you go and make your own comments and do things. Just report accurately what took place. Why were you sent to the court? Why did the court allow the pressman? The court saw everybody taking notes. You don't go and do your own thing. But please report accurately. We left court. All they wanted to hear is sit down. You are my junior. Is that why you, you came to the court? Is that why you were sent to come to the court? I mean, it's, it's not good enough. So please, draw this one. The case is over. So you can make your comments. But I'm warning you, make only comments within, you know, reasonable, in a reasonable manner. Make sure that your comments will not go to, you know, uh, you know, use intemperate if you like never use intemperate language in making comments of the judgment and you'll be fine you'll be fine lord the judges are not living in cloisters they are living in the world they live with us they read what you people write but don't go out of your way to say things which are not true don't go and say things which are not true this is uh, dr oh, indum yeah. station eh? yeah. uh, <laughs> yes